was about to go home and then I saw these ice creams because Sophie showed me and I was like, gotta do a motherfucking review, bitches! Oh my god, I could die. This is my this is my dream come true. What the hell? 7 Eleven. You came through. Oh, this is amazing. Look at this! Look at this! This fucking chocolate mint goodness! Look at it! It's amazing. So this is a chocolate bar called yeah. Burak Sanda. Wow. Burak Sanda. <laughs> Choco mint ice. This one. And it's fucking... I've never seen it in chocolate mint before and this is the first time I've seen it in yeah, chocolate mint. Too. Right? I've never seen this with chocolate mint though. Oh my god. I'm so excited. I was just like, I have to do a review. This is no, so no, for sure. Yeah, oh. sorry, Sophie. Thanks, Sophie. Oh my god. Oh, it smells like the candy, like the chocolate. Oh. And it smells like mint. The calories are not as bad as I thought it would be. Mm, right? Yeah, we both thought they were going to be like 300 plus. Yeah. But the calories are only 283. Calories. If you couldn't see that. Yes. Mmm. I actually want to do like a expectation versus reality video with my brother. Like my brother asking me like, so in Japan is it all robots? And I'll be like, no. Aww. <laughs> no. And that'll be the whole video. Just no. Nah. <laughs> nah. Oh my god. I haven't had the mint ice cream for so long. It's so I think you bought me my first mint ice cream. Oh, yeah? in Japan, yeah. The time when I was on crutches. Mm, the one that I like. Yeah, my favorite one. <laughs> uh, my no, Famima, Famima, Family Mart, Family Mart. Oh, they do really good one. Oh my god, ice cream tester. <laughs> that was my dream job when I was younger. What happened? It's too competitive, man. <laughs> <laughs> My auntie worked at um, Baskin Robbins, I think. Mm. Um, when she was telling me when I was younger, I was like, that's the coolest job. <laughs> she got that's to just have ice cream do. all the time. But then I worked in a chocolate shop and I ate ice cream all the time. And it was really great for like two weeks. And then <laughs> like when I worked in a supermarket and um, I could like empty and clean the, the bread cabinet like where they had all the bread mm. so I could always take like home the pastries that had been bought. It wasn't good for me. <laughs> Same when I worked in a cup of coffee shop I used to make myself frappuccinos all the time oh my when God. it wasn't busy and you could like use any of the not officially but you could use <laughs> any of the you could use any of the syrups and stuff so a lot of chocolate coffee and hazelnut syrup wow. two squirts bro it was like drinking Nutella and you could make a cold version. Oh my god, they have like little chunks of the ice cream, of the chocolate bar in it. They get cookie, right? Mmm. Is it gross if I take it out of here? You do it and... <laughs> like this. Like, big chunks actually. Really big. Of the cookie, yeah. Focus on it. Oh yeah, that's better. Oh yeah, what a good shot. Mm. Mm. <laughs> coffee customers are the worst kind of customer. <laughs> yeah, because you have to deal with them before they get their coffee. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're like a little bit on your... Mm -hmm. You can see it. <laughs> it's dribbling. Thank you. I keep forgetting I'm eating an ice cream because the cookie bits yeah. really like are present. So you end up like munching on the cookie and then you're like, oh, I got more ice cream. <laughs> like, it's really good. It's really good. And I like how it's not milk, like the ice cream in the middle, the mint one is not milky. Mm. It's not like creamy milky. It's pretty icy, if that makes any sense. Yeah, right. Like the mint part, right? Like it's actually kind of refreshing. Mm. It's not too much. It's no. not heavy. It's not a heavy cream. Mint chocolate chip ice cream, but like as a milkshake almost. Like, mm. but it, then without it's melting. the milk, <laughs> without the milk, but it's melting like crazy though. 90 milliliters, a lot of fat. <laughs> that was really good. That no, was pretty good. That was too fast. <laughs> I want another one. That's nice. I like that. 
I like that. I don't feel uh afterwards. No, I don't feel uh. I don't feel uh at all. It's better than the high chip. 1000% better than the high chip. <laughs> I love chocolate chip mint ice creams. Every time I see a new one, I buy it to try it. Every single time, because I just think it's... I just think they do chocolate chip, mint chocolate chip so well in Japan. So, out of all of the ones that I've had here, out of all of the different mint chocolate chip ice creams that I've had here, this is up there, but it's not the best. When I get an ice cream, I want ice cream. Like, I don't want that much biscuit. There was, there's a lot of biscuit in this. I mean, it is 50% ice cream, 50% like Yeah, there's cookie. like a lot of cookie. Like, it's delicious, don't get me wrong. I would prefer the pieces to be smaller mm. and for them to be more mint ice cream. Because I like, I like the mint ice cream. I like when there's something to bite in. <laughs> <laughs> Shall we? Let's rate these. Let's rate it. Eight out of ten. Wow. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty Eight good. Eight out of ten. Oh, that's mine. What's the? What do you not like about it? Because there's a lot of amazing things about this. But yeah, I think that it could. I think it's also one of the good things when I said like it's less creamy in the middle, but also I feel like some of the taste got lost because it was so icy. I feel like it could have been more creamy mint. Right, yeah. Decided direction. Yeah. Go like all out. You've already got the choc you've already got the chocolate coated cookie pieces inside. Yeah. So why not completely go heavy, go ham, or yeah. go home? It's a little then compared to yeah, the cookie I, part, yeah. the mint part was a little anticlimactic. They need to, you know, yeah, in level. Yeah, I agree. I agree. It's like the cookies are, that's like, that's what I'm saying. Like, I think the cookies were too much. Like, you know, either put less cookies in it or really up the ante on the mint chocolate, uh, the mint ice cream. Sorry. Maybe it's because I'm dumb, but like, it was falling apart, right? So, if the coating was thicker, it would have mm -hmm. retained shape better as well. So if the coating was of the chocolate was like thicker, then it wouldn't have leaked and started to fall apart. And I wouldn't have to be like rushing to eat it. Like I shouldn't have to do that. Yeah, the chocolate around could also have tasted like more. Yeah, yeah, it could have been a bit more chocolatey. Yeah. And it, yeah, so it's really delicious, but with all those components, okay. I'm gonna give it an eight. Yeah, eight is good. Eight it's eight. still good, but like it's not a nine it's for just, sure. It could be better. This and it's time. not a 10. No. Yeah. I know the spit out though. Okay, so eight, 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 16 out of 20? That's fair. Yeah. So these were 140 yen each from 7 Eleven, which is prices and Danish krona. It was satisfying, right? Happy with my decision. 140 yen for one is quite a lot. That was the review for Black Sanda Ice Mint Choco. Choco Minto. Choco Minto. Sumasen. Choco Minto. Thank you for joining us today. Look forward to seeing you again in the next video. You know the drill, Sophie. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Bye. Mwah. <laughs>